Hello friends, welcome back. Today started out my Saturday going to donate blood, which was kind of nice to, oops, that's my book. Ooh, Bobby's hat. Reading um, American Dirt <laughs> for book club next week. Um, yeah, it was nice to get the blood, blood donation out of the way this morning. My kids are probably not at home doing their chores. Chelsea has already skirted the um, full length of her chores. I have to, anyway, so I am headed home. Keely already wants me to take her to her friend's house. She is going to work on a project for me. There's a car right behind me. And I'm trying to back up and get out of my spot. And where I'm at, I have to park on the left side of the road. Feels like I'm in Europe. Like a weird roundabout. And they have parking on both sides of the street. Very strange. Very, very strange. But I'm, so I have to go home and take her to her friend's house. But I'm also needing to prep for our three April birthdays, which start next Friday. Today's Saturday. And Easter. So here's the deal with Easter. If you celebrate Easter, know about Easter, whatever, it's next Sunday, not tomorrow. So this is like a weird church scheduling conflict <laughs> that we have with Easter. And maybe I should put my camera down. I'll tell you about it in a minute. Let me drive home, get Kaylee, and then we'll be back and I'll talk to you about Easter. Because we're doing Easter tomorrow, not next Sunday. So I'll tell you, I'll tell you all about that. go home. Marshall's just has a way of like, you know, it's like a magnet pole. If I drive by Marshall's, which I'm not near very often, it's just like I have to go in. So I got, which I don't think my daughter will watch, so I can show you. Um, and if her friends are watching, don't show her. Um, I got some gummy bears or gummy butterflies for a birthday present and I won't show you the other thing because I don't want to ruin that surprise for her. But and if you don't know, if you're new, we have three April birthdays and they start next Friday. So then I got a notebook and this is half my magnet pull to go to Marshall's. Actually, it's a lot of it because I'm obsessed with those notebooks and I just always worry that like one day Marshall's isn't going to carry them and they're $20 online. So I just buy them when I see them and I like them and... I have a whole supply of them, but better safe than sorry, right? So now I think I'm getting text messages from my daughter. Where are you? When are you coming home? Um, let's see here. Yeah, nope, not Kaylee, but I gotta get home to her, so I'll be back in a minute. Okay, Ashley, where did you go with Grandpa today? Target. And why did you go to Target with Grandpa today? Oh, For the first time soon. in two years, you because you haven't gone since your last birthday. With He'll him. always take us out to get something like a treat or like Right, whatever. but he didn't get to do that last year, yeah, right? Because yeah, of COVID. Because of COVID. But, and so it's been two years since he's taken you. You're right, Ashley. So I think Grandpa was in the mode to spoil. Was Especially her. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Ashley, stand up. I'll put the camera down. Hurry. Hurry, hurry, yeah. hurry. Show him. <laughs> Obviously the most expensive <laughs> and big thing. Not the most expensive, but oh, that $15. is pretty cute. It's no, okay. It's, it's okay. Me. Grandpa wanted to spoil his girl. Okay, <laughs> Ashley, now show us what else he got you. It's getting a piggy. I thought that was all you got, but apparently... I just, I got one and then he... He said you had to get two? Well, he wanted... Uh, Here, you put said, it... Do you want to get two? Yeah. All right, I'll show us what you got. Well, I got these, like, sours. Oh. Sour, air, air, what are they called? Sour punch. Sour yeah. punch. And then, those are good, by the way. They're oh, caramel. caramel, okay. And then, two of the sand. Two kinetic sand? Yeah. Oh, by the way, Ashley, you, you are really spoiled. And really good. Very, very spoiled, Ashley. I got two candy. Was it fun? Did you go get lunch? What'd you get? Or, what'd you get? Ice cream. <laughs> Ice cream. Um, <laughs> we're at Dairy Queen. 
No, you probably went to Baskin Robbins. Yeah. Yeah. Lucky. Yeah. All right. Well, we that's really fun. I bought you and you yeah, birthday I presents just I now. Okay. Um, now we have to actually do our chores because yeah. now our friends can't play yet. Can I do it then? After your chores. You went out to play today before doing all of your chores. Oh, while we were at the park? No, you forgot to do all of your chores. No, I didn't. Dishwasher. I didn't forget to do you, the room. I, didn't I know, but you didn't do your dishwasher. Okay, camera's off. one chore. Okay, hang, hang on. All right, Abby is making me some Easter cupcakes. I'll explain why we're doing Easter. I haven't explained that yet. <laughs> but we're going to put a little <gasps> Ooh, egg surprise <laughs> in the middle of every little cupcake and then we're gonna make a little nest on top with our eggs will that be kind of cute yeah wait did you get are these peanut butter peanut butter but they peanut look like peanut. eggs so it's like so a m and m Reese's Pieces mmm <laughs> yeah chocolate yeah. cake whatever all right guys guess what I just got I cannot stand the kinetic sand but I just got something fun in the mail I'm going to show you and I'm gonna be able to wear these on Wednesday next week but I got my vaccine they're vaccine f-a-c-s-e-a-n so it's a little bracelet and you can wear it to show that you have gotten your vaccine right and then the other the other side says band together no pun intended. So I got three of them. They're like $2 online. So I think it's called uh, vaccine, let's see. Yeah, V-A-C-S-E-E-N.org. I'll just put it up on the screen here. Take a screenshot of that if you wanna order yours. Pretty cool. So I got one for Jason. And then um, I thought maybe I would just keep one in my purse. And if, you know, I have a friend. Maybe my father-in-law will want to wear one. So, anyway, that's kind of a fun find that I got online. Are you having fun with your presents from Grandpa? Mm -hmm. Oh, and Abby made the cupcakes. I took Kaylee to her friend's house. That's where I've been. But she made the cupcakes. And there's one batch is out right there. But look at these ones in the oven. You can see the chocolate. Look at that, you guys. Oh. <gasps> That little chocolate egg is melting in the middle. That's gonna be so good. All right, so my errands are all run officially. I hope to be able to stay home for the rest of the day. I hope Jason can go and get Kaylee from her friend's house tonight. But I'm hungry and have me some cottage cheese and an orange and a hot dog. Because <laughs> I want it to be quick. I have a video to edit from yesterday. Trying to get caught up again and it's not happening very fast. So we have birthdays upon us and those videos are gonna be fun and I wanna have the time to edit those. But I need to explain to you. Here, Ashley, can you pop? Here, I'll just set you guys down. But I meant to, yeah, I don't. Okay, we'll chat with you here for a second. Um, so Easter for us is a little bit quirky because it's technically next Sunday. So technically in a week, but but next Sunday we have a few things, right, Ashley? Yeah. So next Sunday is Kaylee's birthday. It is, and I don't, I don't mind her needing to share the holiday. It's not just about that, but I do want to be fair to her getting to have the celebration. But part of it is also because for her birthday we do donuts in the morning and we do cake for the you know dinner time. And Easter, we have Easter candy, and we, you know, we would have done these cupcakes. It would have been a lot of junk in one day. And I don't want to take away any of those things because that's just kind of like a rite of passage to have those things. So that's part of it. The other part is like a religious scheduling thing. So we're Mormons, LDS, Latter day Saint, whatever you want to call us now. And, okay, I don't know how to explain this. So every six months, we have a conference for our church, for the entire church, like worldwide conference. 
It's called General Conference. And it's broadcast out of Salt Lake City, Utah, where I'm from. I'm from Northern Utah. But they broadcast it worldwide. And all of our leaders speak and give us words of advice and encouragement and, you know, that kind of thing. And it's every six months and it's for all weekend. So there's a Friday night session for two hours for the adults. But then on Saturday, there's two different sessions. And on Sunday, there's two different ses sessions. And so the, the whole weekend is dedicated to watching these and being uplifted and I take notes and I sit down and I relax and I watch them on TV. They're broadcast on TV and I really love it and it's quiet and whether my kids watch with me or not, I just have it on and they listen to it and I'm listening to it and I'm burning my hot dog. I sometimes do. I know, you sometimes listen to it. You do want me to do your hair and I do it. I know. I can usually convince a little one to come and join me if they do my hair and I have chocolate or candy or if I also do something else. I actually really enjoyed conference when I when I was growing up when it was on Easter Sunday. Because that was a lot of incentive. My parents would say, you know, you can have your Easter candy, but you have to watch conference. <laughs> so birthday, Easter conference Not it's all on one day technically so if i can take something okay. hang on <laughs> all right so i don't know what part of that i'll have to take out i just realized thanks to chelsea that i was still recording <laughs> i thought i hit the button there's one of our new pans it does everything else well but hot dogs it turns on that stupid smoke alarm every time no matter you're not even burning it anyway so I just switched pans, but okay. So Easter, birthday, and church conference all in one day. I can't church change the church conference. I can't change a birthday. So I've decided to just move Easter celebration here in our family to this Sunday. But also our congregation at church has moved it as well, and I think a lot of them are because technically conference is next week, and so. I have friends that are going out of town for spring break and they're like, I'm just gonna do Easter tomorrow too so that I don't have to do it on break. So that's why we're kind of switching things around just a bit and giving Kaylee her day, her morning, and then we can all sit as a family and watch the conference and, you know. Usually in the past it was, anyway, this really hasn't ever happened where her birthday fell on Easter. It has happened in the past where Easter and conference fell on the same day. Wait, so yeah. this is kind of the first time that all three happened at once and we're having to like switch things around. Luckily with COVID, the whole church thing is easier to handle because it's all virtual mm -hmm. still. Well, we could go in person, but I'm not comfortable with it yet. Should I show that you have a tissue sticking out your nose? because I got a bloody nose and it just oh. won't stop. I'm sorry, I didn't know that. So oh. All right, you guys, the day snuck away from me, but we just put out Easter. It's 11.30. I don't know why I'm whispering. Half of our kids are still awake because a, sm a fire smoke alarm went off when they were trying to cook. But I've got all of their Easter baskets out. We are very minimal on Easter. I'm just gonna say, M&M's, Peeps, and these little lotions. Like, very minimal. This is just for decoration. <laughs> I don't put a whole lot into Easter because the real celebration of Easter is Christ. So, Abby made these little cupcakes. They turned out so, so good to look like grass on the top. She did a really good job with those. These ones are filled with caramel uh, Cadbury eggs and these ones are filled with the regular Cadbury eggs with like the yolky thing in the middle. I'm gonna eat these ones because these ones are gonna be really good. So anyway, and this is just a decoration that I got from my friend. So I didn't decorate for Easter at all. That's as much as we're gonna get, you guys. So take care and happy early Easter. Oh, gotta, we do not need a close up of me. Are you making hot dogs? Yes. Yeah, do you want? Me? Yeah, go get it out. You're still recording. Let's keep that. All right, so I don't know what part of that I'll have to take out. I just realized, thanks to Chelsea, that I was still recording. <laughs>